Bud Grant may be best known as coach of the Minnesota Vikings, but he was a gopher too, a four-year starter from 1946 to 1949. It's been a long time since we've had something to crow about. And he's been waiting to see a season like this. Touchdown, Minnesota! They started out a little slow by winning some close ball games, but they have progressed as years have gone on. And as a coach or a fan, you, you like to see that. You don't want to see a stagnant team. The one thing I am glad about is that the wait is over. Ricky Foggy was another four-year starter for the Gophers from 1984 to 1987, who has continued to follow the team through some pretty lean years. And that's the exciting part, to, to be able to, to witness this, because, you know, we've been waiting a long time. This year's team mirrors Foggy's team in many ways, a losing program turned around by an inspiring head coach, Lou Holtz for Foggy. But what they did tonight was really special. P.J. Fleck for the current and team. But as good as Fleck is, character. Foggy and Grant both believe the caliber of players is the difference maker. No, you got to have the players. I don't care how good you are as a coach. Remember, the coaches don't win football games. Coaches can promote, they can recruit, but the players, you got to get the best players. To make the Big Ten Championship and a trip to the Rose Bowl, the Gophers need to beat Wisconsin on Saturday. Foggy and Grant both beat the Badgers four times although the college football atmosphere was a little different in Bud's day. Tough part of that was it was always the first day of deer season. That was almost as important as the game at that time. Lou Raguse, Care 11 News.